When we realized that we had so much to learn, we started documenting information for later use. Information that now is available all around us. Information on our smartphones to help keep us smart, or at least to make sure that your friends think so about you. Now, we have such a massive amount of information available all around us that we really don't know what to do with it. Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Demystify. I'm Amit Banerjee and in today's episode, we're going to talk about the tribes of people who are working really hard to make meaning out of this incredible amount of data around us. The tribesmen of machine learning. I heard about this term recently when I finished the book The Master Algorithm by Pedro Domingos. Brilliant book, especially from the perspective of someone who is outside the field of machine learning. This book sets the premise by a very ambitious take on that one single algorithm that is capable of discovering knowledge from any given data. That's your master algorithm. And if this conquest itself makes you really excited, then you should know about the five tribesmen of machine learning, who, by the way, represent the five different school of thoughts when it comes to solving the various types of challenges that comes within the field of machine learning. These five tribesmen have massively contributed in shaping various types of algorithms that make our lives easier. Right from the Amazon recommendations that we see that helps us uh, make decisions as to what we should buy next or the Netflix recommendations that we see like you know, which movies that we sh would probably might want to watch bases our viewing choices. So let's try to understand these five tribesmen and in what ways are they trying to contribute towards the master algorithm. So the first is symbolists. They combine logic and philosophy and believe that the key to knowledge is teaching machines to fill in the gaps in knowledge through inverse deduction. Then we have the connectionists who firstly oppose the ideas put forth by the symbolists and they believe that logic does not dictate whatever happens in life. The connectionists believe in neuroscience. They are more interested in knowing how the brain really works. Evolutionaries believe in the work put forth by Darwin and are of the opinion that nature itself is intelligence that has existed for several centuries. So taking inspiration from nature and the theories in evolutional biology, this tribe believes in simulating intelligence that is modeled on evolutionary algorithms. Then comes the Bayesians, which I personally find the most fascinating amongst the tribesmen. They work on the principles of probabilistic inference. The idea is that everything we learn or know is uncertain and we need evidence to eliminate and affirm that state of knowledge. It stems from the Bayes theorem and today has massive applications in crafting efficient algorithms. And finally, we have the analogizers. According to them, intelligence is nothing but analogy. Their origins can be found in the study of psychology. In this approach, the machine learns if A and B have similar interests and B likes something that A is not familiar with, then A will like that something he or she is not familiar with. This idea is something Amazon's recommendation system takes inspiration from. Now these five tribesmen come from five different school of thoughts and have their own unique roots, but they are the ones shaping the many discoveries and possibilities within the world of machine learning. As far as the quest for the master algorithm is concerned, it would require the tribesmen to come together and exchange their notes to build that single entity that would be equivalent to the theory of everything. Now that's quite intriguing when you think about it. If you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe and continue the journey of Demystify, data, design and digital. See you all in the next episode. Cheers.